Our uh, Conan in Haiti special aired last Saturday night. Uh, we're all really proud of it. If you did miss it, you can still see it. Go to teamcoco.com slash Haiti. So, very happy about that. And, uh, Conan! Conan! Uh, yes, yes, sir. So you really visited Haiti, huh? Yes I, yes, I did. Yeah, we made a show about it, yeah. And you've also visited Cuba, Armenia, South Korea, and also other places. Yes. <laughs> yes, uh, traveling is a, is a big part of the show now. We, we love to travel, yeah. Then you should come to my country next. Hello. My name is Francisco Guglioni, and I am the president of Bolivaguay. <laughs> Bolivaguay, I've never, never heard of it. It is definitely a real place. Just look at this map. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, it, it looks like you just drew on a map with a Sharpie. Anyway, <laughs> you absolutely must come to Bolivaguay. It is only a 39-hour flight. I'm sorry, 39-hour flight? Yes, yes, you fly from Los Angeles to Sydney to Los Angeles to Bolivaguay. It's a weird customs thing. Okay, sir, I'm sorry, I cannot visit Bolivaguay, and I'm, I'm sorry. That's right, you can't visit until you get your shots. You see, Bolivaguay was recently ranked number one by the Global Center for Definitely Real Diseases. <laughs> well, then I'm definitely not visiting. Fine, I will list them all for you. There's too many hands disease, the disappointing tingles, Jeff breath, total scrotal confusion, resting bitch ankle, banana syndrome, penile senility, Sumheimer's disease, face apocalypse and the listing fake diseases disease, yeah. which is what I suffer from. Yes, I understand that. <laughs> Mr. President, uh, look. Look around where? Okay, no, 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 don't, don't look anywhere. I'm just an expression. Mr. President, I am not visiting your country, okay? <laughs> okay, fine. But what if I kept talking anyway? Well, I don't think First you land at the lovely Bolivaguay International Airport on the side of an active volcano. Okay, uh, <laughs> I don't know, that looks kind of dangerous. Only on eruption Tuesdays. <laughs> then you'll travel to the capital of Bolivaguay, Bolivaguapolis. And you'll get there in style via ziplining donkey. No. <laughs> there's, I'm sorry, there's no way that that works. Sure it does. You ride the donkey and the donkey ziplines. <laughs> why not just let the people zipline without sitting on a donkey? <laughs> sure, and why not just let the passengers fly the airplane? Ah, right. <laughs> Anyway, your first stop in Bolivacopolis <laughs> will be the Crazy Dance Institute. I have a feeling you'll get a pretty good segment out of that place. Then you'll visit the wall where everyone cries. Oh my God. I'm sorry, does that wall have some deep historical uh, significance? No, it's made of onions. No. <laughs> <laughs> then for the last eight days of the trip, you will relax in the woods. Uh, okay, what do you mean? Relax in the woods. We will just leave you in the woods for eight days where you can relax. No, no, no. I'm sorry. Being lost in the woods is not relaxing. It is in Bolivaguay where the woods are positively infested with wild masseuses. <laughs> wild. I'm sorry. I'm still not coming. I do have one question. Mm. Sir, why all the medals? Oh, these. Uh, that's simple. In Bolivaguay, you receive a medal for every bowel movement. <laughs> oh. Oh, no. Damn it! Okay, what's what's wrong? <laughs> All right, that's disgusting. I I think it should just go. We'll just, see you in Bolivar. No, no, no. I I haven't. <laughs>